Okay. I need um, a xylophone to play this song. Yeah, we have um, some new products, and I also just want to remind everyone, we are shipping. You place an order. We ship it. We're operating sm smart. We're operating safe. We have staggered shifts. We're uh, at reduced uh, capacity uh, as far as the number of people on site at any time. So I want to let you know, even when you place an order, even if it ships fast, it's because we're operating safe and that's what we've been able to do and that's what we're going to continue to do and that's what we're always going to do so we thank you for your orders and uh even adabot got in on thank this you. with the mask here so thank you everybody for yeah. <laughs> your support Staying okay safe. um first up we have a product that a lot of people signed up for you're waiting for it that's now in stock yay we finally put in a bunch of the feather senses if you wanted these you can get as many as you want now, uh, if they're still in stock, which they should be, uh, I, it's a hint. We used to have the green photos, but they actually come in Adafruit Black now. So yeah. we will update these photos shortly. Thank you for your patience. Same exact hardware, just more fashionable. Okay, uh, next up. So you have green PCBs. Uh, here's a feather wing um, that we planned to release a few months ago, and we're finally getting to it now. This is the feather... Um, Nine off IMU wing from ST using ST sensors. It's got the LSM 60 socks and the List 3 MDL. So the LSM 60 socks is a six degree of freedom accelerometer from gy plus gyroscope, and then the List 3 MDL is a very common magnetometer that they use. And together, this gives you nine offs. And so you can use this. Uh, we have a guide on how to use um, Mahoney or other AHRS. Uh, fusion libraries and there's even a library now in circuit python to get orientation data out so uh, check out our guide on it what i like about the lsm 6d socks is it's extremely low noise low drift gyro um, so it's extremely high quality and the price is really good it's very small it's thin um, the sensor is you know you're getting like close to industrial quality gyroscope performance which is what is really key in um, doing orientation sensing. It's the gyroscope that's going to dictate a lot of like how much drift and jitter you're going to see because the gyroscope is the toughest thing to um, to sense well, to sense uh, consistently. Um, and so this is a really nice pairing. Uh, we also have a little stemma breakout if you don't want the whole wing. But what's nice about this is it only uses I squared C, so it works with every single feather from the ESP8266 up to the STM32 F405. And we put a stem detector on the end. So if you want to add more sensors, like let's say you want to make a 10 DOF sensor with um, altitude, uh, toss on a LPS 25. It's an ST uh, bar barometer pressure slash altimeter sensor. And now your drone is ready to fly. Okay, while we're uh, doing this, we can uh, insert a question. Uh, why are there multiple headers in this design? Um, when I have space, I like to break out all the header pins so that when you solder this onto a header, you still have like every pin duplicated. Okay, cool. I don't always have space, but when I do, this is what it looks like. You can see each one is just cross-connected. Cool. All right, and then the star of the show tonight, besides all you awesome folks in the community, the eight of cool team members, and, and more is? Yay, it's the OLED bonnet, also uh, designed by Brian a few months ago, and we've been trying to get this into the store, uh, but we will not be stopped. Uh, finally, we have um, this design ready to go. So this is a bonnet. It sits on top of your Raspberry Pi, or you can see a Pi Zero will work as well. And here's the bottom. So the bottom, you can see there's that two by 20 connector. So this means it plugs into any Raspberry Pi, or actually it, it'll probably even go. Yeah, this one? Uh, no, the one you were just uh, one? Yeah, it'll, it'll plug into any Raspberry Pi, or even like some other Linux board that has a two by 20 connector. Um, and we also put a stem connector on the bottom so you can plug in other sensors. And um, you can, uh, it uses the SSD 1305, which is a fairly common OLED. Uh, we have CircuitPython slash Python libraries for it. Um, but there's also like the Luma library if people want to use non Adafruit libraries. Okay, so. Okay, do you want to do a demo here? Yeah, let's show off the demo. Okay. Because I have the demo. Yeah. So, let me tell it to focus yeah okay so um, this it so it's a hundred and twenty eight compact cable uh, it's a um, yeah, I can move this this way yeah 
There you go. Yeah. It's 128 by 32 pixels, but they're really chunky pixels, right? So it's the same as our Pi OLED, which is a tiny, like one inch diagonal. This is like two and a quarter inch diagonal, um, but it's really bright because each pixel is like a gigantic OLED. Um, in this case, I plugged into the Stemma Connector uh, MPU 6050, and I'm just having the accelerometer and gyroscope and uh, temperature data come out so you can see that. And this code is all written in Python. It's one of the examples for this library. Um, and then uh, this is kind of what it looks like on the bottom. This is the prototype. Um, you can see it's got this very long connector and it kind of goes around and under, uh, but it tucks in nicely. Um, and this is taped solidly on, so you don't have to worry about this little puffy part. If it gets squished, it's okay. So this nice big OLED. Um, I like it because you can see it from very far away. It's like an extremely bright display. Um, and what's nice is that we already have so many example codes for like uh, pie hole or um, showing your pie statistics or you know showing sensor data. You can of course do graphics as well. It doesn't have to do text, but you know, text of course is easily readable. Um, and you can display animations on it. And you can do about 30 frames per second of animations. So that's the start of the show. Okay, and with that, OLED. is that? Yay!